Just because your kid is smart enough to use an Android device, that doesn't mean they're prepared to see everything that's available online. That's why parental controls exist. You also don't necessarily want your child racking up hundreds of dollars in in-app purchases while you're blissfully unaware. Again, parental controls, but in a different way. We're gonna show you how to do both, and we're gonna start with Google Family Link. The first step is to install the Google Family Link app on the device you use. The nice thing about this app is that it's available on both Android and Apple devices. So even if you use an iPhone, you can control your child's Android phone, for example. Once that's set up, install the Google Family Link app on the device your child or children are going to use. You'll set up a special second Google account for this, or an account for each of them. Once that account is active, go back to your device and follow the prompts to finish linking the accounts. Now have your kids sign in on their device. Any changes you make on the Google Family Link app will now automatically apply to their device. So for example, you can go through their apps and see which ones they're allowed to use and which ones they're not allowed to use. Open the Family Link app, choose the account you want to make changes to, then scroll down to App Installs and tap View All Apps. If you see an app you want to block, just tap on it, then toggle the Allow App slider to off. You can also set up limits for screen time. Open the Family Link app, select the Profile to Manage, then select the card titled Daily Limit and tap Edit Limits or Set Up if you're doing this for the first time. Here you can select which days you want limits applied for and how long you want to allow your kid to use the device. That's not all you can do with the Google Family Link app. You can also monitor activity and even track your child's location. What about that pesky Play Store and those in-app purchases though? Fortunately, there's an even simpler solution for that. Open the Google Play app. At the top right, tap the profile icon, then choose Settings. Now go to Family, Parental Controls. Now turn on parental controls and you'll be prompted for a pin. Now select the type of content you want to filter and how to restrict access. There you go. Now your kid's Android device is much safer for both them and your bank account. For more information and frequently asked questions, make sure to check out the companion article over at maketecheasier.com. We'll put a link down in the description. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.